How's it going, YouTube? Yeah, Pat Mac here, coach for the Sacramento Saints slash playing week two of the WPF up against Mama, coach of the Pocket Monster University. You can see our team above, their team down below, both teams range in speed door, of course, as well as six Pokemon that we are bringing and the six Pokemon that I think Mama, Mama I think it's Mama, is going to bring to our match. Uh, anyway, so part of our game plan here, well, let me actually call this out. You might notice our game plan, and if you watch week one, you'll notice that the game plan is exactly the same. Uh, that's because it is exactly the same. Uh, Intimidate here is going to be important as well. Uh, they have Intimidate on their side uh, from Landers. I think that's going to um, matter quite a bit. Uh, we have both Competitive and Defiant on our mons this week. So I'm really hoping to get that boost and then just go absolutely nuts uh, with Annihilate or um, Kilowattrel. So I think both those mons are going to be really nice. Terra Fairy looks really good against our team again uh, on Garchomp, and then Houses are going to be nice as well. Um, their only removal is Pinaco, uh, and then they do have Hatterene to bounce back Hazard, so I kind of need to be a little careful about that. But they have a ton of Hazards as well. Our removal is not great, so we'll see what ends up happening. Uh, as well as we'll see what six they decide to bring here in just a moment. All right, here we are in the match, and it looks like... Okay, there's a couple of different things that I thought weren't going to come. Is there... There's a rev of room. What's not here? Oh, there's no Braylon. Okay. Uh, that sounds fine. Uh, I think my play is probably um, to use Overquill, I think, um, as a potential check to that. It does, like, okay um, against it, so I kind of got to be a little careful. Uh, all right. So as far as lead goes, um, I don't know. There's a ton of different things I think I could lead. Honestly, probably Samrot's the one of the better leads it just kind of just it just does good damage against everything um and then i can always wish it back up later on and yeah yeah actually i kind of like that um it has like knockoffs so i can just got some items uh get some solid damage it doesn't get okra by anything which is really nice and yeah i think this makes a lot of sense now i'm thinking more about it so good luck have fun over to mama should be a pretty good game uh, with the little bit extra time I have here, uh, I will say that we he didn't join the competition um, before it started, which last gen when you were doing the online competition method, you had to join it before the competition started, which is like, it is such, such a massive boost um, to, to this game to um, for that not to be the case. So yeah, that's actually really nice. I'm really glad that they changed that. Fenrir. Okay, that's fine with me. Uh, I think my play is... You know, honestly, not 100% sure, actually. I kind of like the idea of just going for a knockoff. Like, this is going to switch out, right? So, like, what's it switching into? Like, Ice Beam or um, Surf could be coming. Uh, I don't th think Air Slash is my play. I think I'm just going to go for a knockoff. I feel very certain that this is just going to swap. And I don't really need to do a whole lot of damage um, against this. I mean, I guess I could have gone for Ice Beam, right? Yeah, like in case they decide to just like set rocks and sack this, which I guess is a legitimate play. But I'm kind of cool with just knock and then go for a move afterwards. Probably Surf. Yeah, probably Surf after this, but we'll see. We'll see what they decide to do. Cool, they're really thinking on it. Yeah, they swap. Okay, I kind of, I kind of assumed they were going to. Now that makes me think that they are not Spark. Oh, this is fine with me. Yeah, so I'm gonna knock off whatever their item is, which is awesome. Uh, what item did they have? They had Punching Glove. Okay, kind of assuming it'd be Punching Glove. I'm just gonna go for Air Slash. This is kind of my check to this mon. Kind of like I gotta be a little careful about um, uh, with the. Um, I, I gotta be careful about close combat, but um, we'll get a sense for how much uh, damage this thing is packing. Probably a lot. Probably gonna be like Jolly or Adamant, um, but we'll see. Yep, we'll see. They're still thinking. U-turn, all right, that's fine. Um, what'd I do? I think I air slashed, right? So I'm kind of I'm kind of chill with this. <laughs> this is kind of okay. I don't. I haven't had a real need to switch out yet, and I don't actually know what what would cause me to switch out. Like, yeah, I don't know. I'm not really sure which Mon is going to make me switch out here. I can kind of just keep going for some damage output. They don't really know my set either, per se. They might have calculated the knockoff damage, I guess, but um, 
they're gonna find I'm like pretty defensive or at least I'm not offensively invested I guess so we'll see oh boy what's he gonna go into now this is kind of nice actually there's not really a whole lot that's that's really threatening Samurott but it's taking a little trip damage at this point nothing too crazy Okay, Skeletor, that makes sense. Um, so Air Slash shouldn't do too much. I think now I'm just going to go for Surf. Oh, I couldn't have knocked off. Actually, I probably should have used Knock Off on this. Well, yeah, yeah I probably should use Knock Off right here. Just get rid of another item. But he's figuring out a little bit more about my set. Now he'll know I'm more special than physical. And they do Terra. Okay, so what are you turning into? Do you tear into something that's still weak to water? No, you actually tear it into water. Okay. Uh, in that case, I think my play is go... Probably go Florges. So Surf should do very little damage. So this is actually going to cause me to switch out now. Um, just because I don't do a whole lot of damage to this. Uh, do I go Florges? I could go Florges, but I don't really want Reverend to come in uh, for free. I could also go into Frigate. Let me just check to see how um, how well Kilowattril does here. Ah, do I really want to go into Kilowattril? Let me think here. Because I don't really want to allow... Well, actually, I kind of do, right? Yeah, I think this is fine. I could also go into Forges, but I think... Yeah, let's go, let's go Kilowattril. Like, I threatened it with, with some... Uh, with at least an electric move, right? So, um, this is Kill... Terra Water now. Gonna have to keep that in mind. And they just shot a wall. Okay, how much are we taking here? Ooh, okay, that's a little bit more than I thought I was gonna take. Um, actually, it's probably about right. So I think now... <sighs> Let's see, I'm at 164. Would I die to another Shadow Ball? Yeah, it's got a small chance to KO here, just depending on how much investment they have. I could go for, I think I go for Volt Switch. If they bring in um, uh, Landorus, then I don't really, I don't really want to take that hit either. You know, what? I'm gonna go for Roost. Yeah, yeah they go, they swap. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go for Roost here. Let's stay a little bit healthy. Cosmo Delady. Oh, okay, that's fine. Uh, so I think now I just go for Volt Switch. Yeah, that gets us back up to full. Uh, I think Volt Switch is just fine. I could go for Hurricane also. Um, hmm, do I want to go Hurricane? Now let's go Volt Switch. I think I Volt Switch and go into Florges. I mean, that's probably okay. I'm not really sure what this mod is going to do, but I can probably go Florges uh, on this. But this is definitely looking like a very slow game, just how this is playing out. We know we have Terra Water. If I get any chip damage on the Landris, then we probably KO it uh, just straight up. Even like defensive, I think. Yeah, even defensive. If I if I get the plus two boost here, then we can KO like max AP Landris pretty easily. So I think I just go Florges. I feel like that's probably just a safe call. I can pretty much take whatever hit they go for. They could like nuzzle, I guess. Yeah, nuzzle. Okay. That, and, like, that's not a big deal. Um. Do I call the Reverend Room play? I mean, I could, right? So I'm actually still faster. That's actually good information to have. Uh, do I want to call the Reverend Room play? I could, I guess. Right? Like, this is probably swapping out. Um, they go into Reverend Room potentially. What else could they go into? That's kind of it, right? Uh, do I just swap out here? I could go into Frigate. Uh, calling the Rev of Room. I could, I kind of like just going Garchomp. And then I could look to Liquidation potentially. I really want to get some Swarm of Hazards up though. So do I go into Sub Boom? I'm a little concerned that this is. Um, Hmm. Yeah, I'm a little concerned that this is just like... Oh, I'm just going to Moonblast. 
Yeah, I, I feel like this is gonna be a baton pass. Reflect. Oh my gosh, screens. Okay. I mean, that's fine, I guess. So they're nuzzle, maybe dual screens. Uh, in that case, I mean, I could just move blast again. I could also call mine here. Uh, ooh, okay, I need to be a little careful about how I play this. Because uh, if this is... Hmm. Yeah, if this is a... Um, like a shift gear uh, sweep uh, option, then I need to be a little careful about how I play around that. I think I go into... Huh. No, I don't really want to do that yet either. Okay, I'm gonna move last. Okay, I think it's Rubber Room. Star Leon. Probably Rubber Room? Yeah, okay. I think I need to go into Overquill. I gotta be a little careful about how I play around this Mon. I could also go Garchomp, actually. But I like the idea of Rubber Room here. Um... I don't have to, right? Like, I can probably just go Garchomp on this. Let me let me check River Room calcs a little bit more. Because uh, if this is uh, like a shift gear set, then I just want to make sure that I can handle it. Yeah, I think I think I just go into Garchomp. Yeah, I think I just go Garchomp. Because if they do try to shift gear, even with Reflect, like we're, we're almost capable or almost KO, I guess. We'll see. Let's see what they do. Yeah, they should here. Okay, so I gotta be a little careful about how I'm playing around this, but I think Earthquake is just the way to go. Because I think with Reflect, we're still doing a ton of damage. Um, and we should be able to... Actually, probably this plus some uh, ship from uh, our Rough Skin probably is enough to do it. But I need to make sure I'm very careful around this mod. This, this is... Not an easy mod for me to deal with. Um, thankfully, it doesn't have Terra. God, if it was free Terra on this room, I'd be very scared. Okay, so they go Landris, I'm assuming. Yeah, they go Landris. Actually, now that might be okay. Because if it's Landris... Yeah, see, Landris might be fine. Because if I... Like, I could uh, try to set up on this. There's one turn Reflect left. I know for sure it's only got one turn left. Like, I want a sword stance. I mean, honestly, sword stance isn't doing, isn't doing a whole lot, even after this, so maybe I don't. Maybe I just swap here. Um, yeah, maybe I just swap. Because even defensive Landris isn't taking... Or, like, defensive Landris isn't taking much. If it's offensive, could it be offensive? If it's offensive, then... I could maybe go uh, like Samurott, but I don't really want to take that damage for free, right? Like I almost wanted to Sword Stance in front of this. Let's go and do that. Yeah, they're right there. Ooh, they're faster. Okay, and that means, and they did what, 180 something? Okay, I don't really want to take another EQ actually. I don't really want to take another EQ, so I'm gonna go Kilowatt Roll. I'm gonna go kill Watchroll, and then I can, um... Yeah, see, without Reflect, though... Without Reflect, I feel like our Garchomp does so much damage with Liquidation, but we don't actually KO. So I think I just go kill Watchroll. We'll save Garchomp for later. They know we're SD, but honestly, worst things could happen. And then I think I just have a free uh, Volt Switch. Yeah, I just have a free Volt Switch. Um, or do I want a Thunderbolt? No, I'm just gonna full switch. They got a swap, so what do they go into? Ooh, I need to make sure that I get Forge, or uh, not Forge, just, um, Garchomp healthy again. So this is probably another set of screens coming up, huh? Alright, I think I go Overquill this time. I go Overquill. And, or do I just go back into allergies? Because I get allergies, wish into Garchomp. I kind of like how that sounds. 
Yeah, I like how that sounds. My concern is Perez. Like, Perez could be really tough here. But I think this is still the play. I'm hoping to be able to wish in a Garchomp. That would be ideal. But I also need to be careful about how I'm playing around this Landers. It is good for me to know it's Scarf, though. And the River Vrima Shift gear. Yeah. We do get our wish. Okay, that's really nice. I'm probably going Garchomp pretty much no matter what. They baton pass. I mean... This is probably okay, right? Because they probably baton pass into Revan Room. And then I get back into Garchomp. And then we repeat this cycle again. How do I break out of this cycle? Because I know Garchomp won't die to any one hit from um, Revan Room. Oh, this is... This might be fine, actually. Because I could go... Uh, I think it's very likely that they... will o -wis. No, they probably don't will o -wis, right? I think I can go Frigate, though. Let's go Frigate. And then, when I go into Frigate, I kind of want a Hurricane. Like, I really just want a Hurricane here. Is it a good play Torch Song? Probably not, actually. Okay, so I think now we need to full switch. Well, after actually that, if I took about half from that, plus one probably doesn't do as much, right? So I could Hurricane here, and then um, Volt Switch the next turn. Yeah, I'm gonna try to Hurricane. Okay, we get the Hurricane. This will be some nice damage. Confusion is obviously amazing for us. Um, but it is likely... I don't think we take enough to die, though. Oh, wow, we get super lucky. Okay, wow. That's honestly insane. Uh, so my play now, I think, is... I mean, it's basically the same turn as it was before last time, right? Like, I just have to Hurricane again. Yeah, I basically just have to Hurricane again. I could have Volt Switched on this one, actually. I think Volt Switching on this one would have been fine, too. Just based on how much damage we did, it looks like they take another, but I think we take a... Um, oh, they swap. Do they go Landorus and give us a competitive boost? Nah. Ah, oh, man, never lucky. Well, I guess we got lucky last turn. <laughs> we, got, we got hella lucky last turn, to be honest. Uh, I'm, fi I'm fine to just Volt Switch on this one. So far, things are going pretty well for us. Uh, Volt Switch should be enough here, right? Yeah, we get, we get the KO. Okay. And then, so what do we go into now? So there's no more screens, which is amazing. Uh, I don't want to let Rev Room in for free. Do I go Bruce? What does that bring in? Bruce could bring in a lot, actually, but I do get some a little bit of leftover recovery. Uh, and nothing Oko's me. Yeah, I think Bruce is fine. I'm going to get a little bit HP recovery here. If they go into Landorus, then I probably go... Hmm. If they go Landorus, what am I going into? Because if it's, if it's Landorus... Man, I really want to get... Well, I can get Hazards up now, right? Yeah, I can get Hazards up now pretty easily. I can't go into... You go into this. Um. Yeah, that's fine. So, I guess now I go into Florges. And maybe I skill swap. Because then this is never basically never beating me. But I, need to, I just need to be very careful about how I'm playing around... Um, so maybe I use Overquill to check this now. Uh, I also make sure I need to use the same route a little bit better. Uh, because the... Hmm. Yeah, I could go... Yeah, I think I could go... Um... Yeah, I think I could do this. I'm a little concerned that they might have... 
Because I think I just go Barbarage, I feel, is my play. Try to get a poison on it. Yeah, they lock off. That's okay. That's honestly fine. Because uh, I think now I'm just going to go for uh, Barbarage. Getting some spikes up would be cool too, but I kind of like the idea of getting a po uh, poison chance. It's got a very good chance of poisoning too, which is really nice. And if I can get this poison, then we get uh, like some serious chip on it. And then I honestly could potentially just like spikes until I die, maybe. This is fine. Okay, what are you going into though? Uh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, this is okay. Yeah, we get the... Yeah, this is perfect, actually. So without an Intimidate, we still take... Or we still deal with her. What am I trying to say here? We don't take that much damage. <laughs> so I'm kind of cool to just uh, Barbarage this. We probably pick up a KO. And... I mean, are you gonna go for... I mean, this is what Samrod's here for, right? Let, let's let's use Samrod for what it's here for. It's here to take on the Urshifu. Um, this could be a close combat, it could be a Surging Strikes. I mean, either one of those is fine. Um, close combat does way more than I want it to, but Surging Strikes is gonna be like nothing. And then I think they are potentially going to Overquill. Uh, and if they don't, or not Overquill, um... Skeledurge. And if they don't go Skeledurge, like, that's not really the big deal. Because I could just go back into Sub-Boom here. I don't think there's any way you go Landris, right? But if you do go Landris, then I get the Intimidate. Um, and that seems okay for me. So I think I swap and we go into Sub-Boom here. And if you go... Yeah, I think this is okay. Yeah, let's go and do this. Because if I can get a spike, that would be amazing. Oh, they actually stay in. I'm surprised at that. I thought they would have swapped. They're probably going CC then. Because there's nowhere that they're slower. Oh, they gave you turn. Oh, that makes sense too. That makes sense too. Um, okay, in that case, it's probably Landers coming out. Oh, I forgot they had U turn. That was a misplay, I think. I think should have just stayed in and attacked it. I think I could have gone for. Knockoff? I probably could have gone knockoff, actually. That would have been... Yeah, knockoff was the play. That's alright. We're doing okay. Yeah, knockoff was 100% the play, wasn't it? Oh well. Oh well. Um, honestly, now that the Urshifu is chipped, I can probably use Samrot uh, much more freely. Uh, like, maybe if they go into Landers, I might not even go uh, Samrot. But we'll see. We'll see what they decide to do. Fenrir, yeah, they, so they go Landris. Uh, now, if there's Scarf, then I'll take... Yeah, I mean, I know there's Scarf, right? Uh, I think it's fine for me to... Yeah, I, like, I should swap, right? There's no reason for me to stay in here. Actually, Earthquake doesn't KO. Oh, wait, I'm lying. It does. It does. D just, just kidding. Just kidding. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to go Salty. I think that's okay. Like, I don't really need this Pokemon for anything else. And then this gets me some free uh, swap options. Thank you, turn. Okay, that's cool too. And then what are they going into? Honestly, it doesn't matter what they go into, right? Uh, I basically just want to stop the momentum, and that's what that's what a uh, Samrod does right here. But I don't know what they're gonna do. They go what river from? Not, honestly, not quite sure. I do need to be very careful about this Rubber Room, though. Like, this is this is how I lose the game, I think, is if Rubber Room gets a chance to sweep. This is getting chip on my team, but it's not enough that it matters. The Rubber Room could eventually just lose by, uh, like, winning the game. Yeah, see, this is bad. This is very bad. Because uh, if this is shift gear... Like, I might have to just get some ship on this and then go into something to revenge. Because I don't 
think I died at anyone hit on other mons. Uh, actually, do I go just go for Quill? I think I go over Quill. Yeah, I think I need. I think I just need to go over Quill. Uh, they can kind of set up on over Quill a little bit, but uh, I think I'm looking at like using this to get some ship damage on it. At least the Intimidate is nice. They gun cut. Okay, cool. They just attack straight up. That's perfect for me. Uh, this is... I don't want to let this set up, actually. So I think I have to attack it. Uh, and I think my play actually is just going to be Liquidation. Yeah, I'm just going to Liquidation here. Hmm. This is... This is... This is... Potentially the wrong call. Potentially the wrong call. They do have Gunk Shot, though, so it's nice to see that part of their set. They have Shift Gear. They swap. Okay. <sighs> That's so good. Like, I really needed that swap. This is perfect, actually. I want Chip on this mod. So this is this is really good. Uh, do I want to call the... Um... God, that, that damage is so, so good. Do I want to call the U-turn? I don't think I need to. I don't think I need to call the U-turn. I can go. I can go skill slot FD. Because honestly, if they um, if they swap back into Rev Room, then I could look to do something different, I guess. Yeah, the U-turn. Um, yeah. But getting that chip damage on um, what's the name of that mon? Landers is really good. So what are you going into? Are you just going to go back into Rev Room? What are your moves on Rev Room? Who's this? Oh, this is fine. Um, did I already knock off this guy's items? I don't think I did. I'm kind of just fine to just let this go down and take the knockoff KO. Um, yeah, I kind of like how that sounds. Yeah, I'm kind of just cool to, like, just pick up, um, pick up a little bit of damage and then let this go down. Oh, they have boots. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, so we'll lose, um, the Samurai here, but at this point I'm, I'm cool with sacking it. And just based on how much damage we know, um, Frigate takes, I can go into this and I can Hurricane. Um, pretty, yeah, pretty freaky, I think. What are my calcs for? Do I take a hit from... I take Jolly Lando Stone Edge. I just don't know if it's Jolly or Adamant. But I really want to catch the Lando coming in. Think I'm gonna, thinking I'm going to go for uh, a, uh, a Volt Switch. Because Volt Switch would be so nice right here. Be so good. Oh my god. Please? Competitive? Please? That's that's not gonna be competitive. Ah oh, man! Ah <laughs> oh, man! <laughs> uh, that is really good damage though. Oh my god. Uh, I'm kinda... Wait, do I...? No, no, I, I don't... I don't know for this. Uh, we just full switch, I guess. Yeah, we just full switch. Getting chip damage on this is really good. I think now I want to look to set up a spike if I can. If I can bring, um, oh, that's okay. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. So then I go over Quill. And over Quill gets me, nets me damage on this, or, um, or I get a spike up. Yeah, because this is hella low now. Yeah, you ship here, but they should not KO. They shouldn't have enough damage to KO me. Uh, so I need to make sure I play play safe around this. I'm just gonna uh, crunch this. It does the most damage, and it doesn't really matter um, what comes in per se. But I need just to make sure that I can actually deal enough to um, to KO. Perfect. Okay, that's that's honestly great. So now Rubber Room is gone, and that was a huge threat to what we had going on for our team. Huge, huge problem. I'm less scared about what can potentially sweep me now. Hmm. What do they go into? 
Urshi too, huh? Uh, I mean, I don't need this for anything else. So I'm gonna try to get a spike. Yeah, I don't need this for anything else. Surgeon strikes, yep. We'll go down to that. That's okay. And then I guess, um... Like, do I go Terra Fairy now? No, 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 because uh, Landris is still a problem, right? I could go... I mean, I just go back into to Kill Watch Roll, right? I think I go back into Kill Watch Roll, and uh, then we're looking at... Is the play Hurricane? All right, I need to check Kilowatt Roll against Delandris. Yeah, see, I can take Jolly, I can't take Adamant. But if they Stone Edge, then I could go into... What do I want to do here? I'm gonna Volt Switch. Yeah, okay, cool, we'll, we'll pick up this scale. I felt like it was a very good chance that they were going to sack it. And then I think my play is now... Um, is it Annihilate? Hold up, is it Annihilate time? Because <clears throat> if I can go... <clears throat> yeah, if I can go Annihilate... Or do I just go into Florges? And Florges... Um, yeah, actually, I think it's Florges. I think it's Florges. Ooh, I think I have some water here. Yeah, see, they gotta figure out what they're gonna do. I think it's... Oh, yes. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. Okay. Now we get to show the tech. Yep, that's fine. Didn't do very much damage. Oh, that's a crit, too. Oh, come on, game. Don't do this to me. This is not the way. <sighs> I really want this skill swap. If I get this skill swap, then this mod is not a threat. Oh my god, two pairs in a row? Oh no. Uh, that's super bad, actually. Uh, okay. Yeah, because now they're at plus two on this. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Um, does it make sense for me to try to swap here? They're at plus two on Torch Songs. Like, Annihilate will take quite a bit, but it might be, it might be one of my better options. Maybe. Annihilate, unfortunately, isn't doing a whole lot, but I need the... God, I need this one healthy, though. But I'm really concerned about another one actually just straight-up KOing. Yeah, I think I have to go Bane. Oh, this is so bad. I took way too much damage there. Damage I should not have taken. I got crit in a double paras. But I pretty much like, I feel like I have to go this. I have to go this one after I have to try to get as much chip as I can. So I'm just gonna go Rage Fist here. Uh, the next one kills me, unfortunately, but this is pretty much what I have to do. So we just gotta Rage Fist. God, that's so, so bad. Cause Shadow Ball KOs, like basically everything KOs now. But if I can, yeah. Oh, it's so so terrible. I need I need chip on this so that Thunderbolt KOs though. I think that's kind of the situation I'm in right now. And actually, Garchomp isn't doing very much for me either. So I may try to get chip with Garchomp also. Um. This is, this is not good. 
If I can get any chip damage on this though. Well, are they allowing me to to get enough? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think I just have to try to Rage Fist though. Like just try to do as much as I can. Because I'm pretty sure another uh, Torch Song KOs. Yeah, even Shadow Bolt does. Yeah. Or Shadow Bolt definitely will. Yeah, that's so bad. Letting them get to plus two is like worst case scenario for me. Because it means I basically need to sack. Um, like I have to go here. Volt Switch, I think. I don't think they're max but F. Let me see if I can get a read for what they're, um, how much damage they're going to take from this. They're probably what, like, that's probably about 75% right now. So I think my play is Volt Switch. I think it's fine to Volt Switch. I'll let Garchomp go. Ah, oh, I don't really want to let Garchomp go, but I think I, I'll, maybe it's Volt Switch, let Floor just go. Oh, this skill suck would have been go so good. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's so rough. Yeah, see, they know they take one. If I had Thunderbolt, that was game. Oh my god, I think if I had Thunderbolt, that was game. Uh, Alright, I think this is the one that we have to let go. Yeah, this is the one we have to let go. And then I guess um, from here, I... Yeah, yeah. Dang, double crit on this one. Poor Floor just taking all the crits. And then actually even Garchomp KOs from here. So I'm fine to just go Garchomp. I think I Terra. And um I think it's just Terra Terra Fairy Terra Blast. Um yeah, because I need I just need to KO this Mon. Oh my god, that's so, 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 so rough, though. This game is becoming a lot harder than it should have been. Like, I I, sh I think I should have been in a very good position. But the the nuzzle actually was, was pretty important earlier on. If we don't KO, like, I don't know. Like, we better. <laughs> right? Okay. Whew. Yeah, that Skeletor put in way more work than it was supposed to. Now, if they go, if they go into Landorus, so Landorus T, hmm, do I want to call a Stone Edge? I'm kind of fine to just hit this, I guess. Yeah, I'm just gonna hit this with Liquidation. Yeah, they do go Stone Edge. We might actually take another one. It's very possible we take another one here. I'm not 100% sure on the damage counts, but I feel like we do. And then I'm really hoping that we can beat the Roaring Moon in the back, actually. <gasps> no way. They did not just sack this Roaring Moon. Oh, I did go for Liquidation, huh? I mean, I can just use Terra Blast, right? Attack was heightened? Okay, so it's not speed. Yeah, that's not going to do very much damage. But now I... Oh, we get a defense drop. That probably doesn't matter, actually. I'm going to be real. That actually probably doesn't matter. Because uh, we either are going to take an Iron Head or we're not. And then... Um... Well, let's see. Do I take an Iron Head from Roaring Moon? I'm going to guess no. I'm going to guess no, because uh, they got to pretty much be adamant, right? Do they have Iron Head? I guess we're going to find out, right? They do have Iron Head. We probably died to that. Was it the play to go kill a Watcher on that? Oh, I feel like I might lose this. I feel like I might actually just straight up lose this because... Um... Oh, that's so, so rough. Maybe I should have used Terra Blast last turn. Maybe I should use Terra Blast last turn. I feel like the ah, I feel like those those paras are gonna come back to bite me. I mean, there's other plays I could have made, right? 
Oh, they're still faster. Wait, did I not speak to this? I must not. <gasps> we get the competitive boost! Wait, is this gonna be enough? I don't think it is. I don't think it's gonna be enough. This one has like insane spit up. Yeah, we actually just missed the attack. Damn! That's so, so bad. All right, well, we're gonna take the 2 0 loss here. I mean, is there other plays I could have made? I mean, I guess maybe I could have tried to. Oh, I don't know what I could have done. I could have tried to use maybe Annihilate a little bit earlier, try to get some more damage off on it, but I don't know. Like it, or like get some more Rage Fist, that's kind of what I'm thinking. But I don't know if that was worth it to try to like take that damage and then uh, get set up in some way. I also could have considered like Scarf on something for my team, but I don't think that was the way either. Yeah, I mean, if we got in a position where we skill swapped the, the Skeledurge, then like, I could have calm minded on my side, or even just wished. Like, I could have used Wish on my side, and then gotten into something, maybe. Because uh, then at that point, it would have been a little more scary for them, but... Yeah, I don't know. I mean, good game over to, to Mama. Like, I think in the end, they end up playing it well. Just, like, allowing their Skeledurge to, um, to do a bunch of damage. And then maybe I just should have gone for a Thunderbolt on the Kilowattril. But I really needed the... Um, the floor just to be healthy to try to take on the Roaring Moon. But if it was attack boosting uh, Roaring Moon, then like I probably didn't take very take it very well on. I mean, I would have taken one on Florges. Yeah, I don't know. In the I'd have to look back at that to figure out where exactly I went wrong. But I feel like the paraturns are, are where it went like really wrong for me. And there wasn't much else that I could have done um, aside from that. Like just sometimes the the game messes things up for you. But in terms of like decisions, I think that was the right decision to make. Ah well. Anyway, good uh, good game over to uh, Mama. If you'd like to see some more of our content, definitely stick around, like, subscribe, and all that stuff. And I'll catch you on the next one.